Okay, here it is, guys. It's a calm day here. It's cold out, about 30 degrees, but I uh, thought I'd give you a test flight of my transparent or semi transparent little micro foam Telemaster version 3. This thing flies so slow because it's just light. I'm going to fly right over the top of you, Wyatt, and try to get, get it in so yeah, you can okay. be able to look right through the wing. Get it? Yeah. Do a little low flyby here, show you how slow it flies. And this thing just floats. Like I was saying, I've tried to build this thing as light as I could possibly do it. It sure looks cool in the air. And it's so easy to fly. Do you think this one flies better than the other one? Yeah, it's definitely easier to fly. The downside with this one is it's made out of Depron. With all these light little holes cut out to make it lighter, it's definitely more brittle. So a very hard hit, I'll take it off again. A very hard hit, it I think would break up pretty bad. but about four feet and it's in the air. Here, I'll bank the other way and turn. I just think it's neat being able to look through the whole body and everything as you're flying gives it just a really neat, uh, neat look to it. Oh, here goes my battery. Better bring it in. Let me check. I think the battery was just about done. Now well, there's a little left. I'll try it. Nope, I was wrong. Battery's just about done. So there it is, guys. The micro transparent Depron foam Telemaster version 3 I'm calling it uh, I've made three versions first version I didn't even get on film because it didn't turn out that great and it was more of just a sample uh, I was just doing mainly glide tests with it to see how it was gonna work out because I know scaling down planes sometimes does not work but in this case it was pretty close, like I said, I had to do a little adjusting on it, but uh, uh, what a cool little plane. They're inexpensive to build. A uh, person, you probably wouldn't get much more than about, oh, 80 to to $100, and that's being pretty generous. And, you know, motors, batteries, servos, linkages, a sheet of Depron or Dollar Tree foam board is a was the direction I would go if I was gonna build one of these. These are great for beginners um, because they are inexpensive and if you build two or three fuselages and wing sets at a time then if you crash one it's not hard and not a big heartbreak if you pile one up. Generally you don't hurt any electronics you just bust up the airframes. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed this. Please give the video a, a thumbs up. Uh, I really
really appreciate it.